niagizo la serikali ambalo kufika sasa wa Kenya wamesalia kutilia maanani hii ikiwa ni pamoja na kujitenga na wengine kuvaa barakoa hadharani na hata kuosha mikono mara kwa mara agizo bora zaidi katika vita dhidi ya janga la corona asubuhi nyumbani mwa familia ya chalo kwa kawaida wakati huu nyumba hapa husalia bila mtu yeyote wazazi wakiwa kazini huku watoto wakisalia darasani tayari kwa somo la siku okay. ila leo na kwa wiki kadha sasa mambo hayajasalia kuwa kawaida Nyumbani sasa kumesalia kuwa kuna kufanyika shughuli za kawaida. My employer uh, just said uh, guys uh, from this date yeah, we are going to wait until these things clears. And now here we are staying at home. We had to release our house help because now we are at home. We are we don't need we are not going out. We have the kids alone so na kwa kuwa binadamu hupenda kutangamana janga la corona limesitisha hilo kwa muda kwani watu hawatangamani kama zamani wakiwa manyumbani the baby here pia na yako na ile anataka ile attention ibaki <sighs> mam kama utaki tufanye wacha niende nicheze like ufai kwenda nje kuna corona kwani hii corona ndio nini pia wao nime realize wamekuwa scared na corona mtu kusikia corona iko associated na kifo familia sasa pia wamesalia kukabiliana na adui mwingine anayelenga si akili pekee bali pia mwili ya binadamu we don't know how long we are going to stay once again here so if now the stress catches up with me now and for god forbid it takes around 2 4 5 months from now mm. it will carry me away with it before the corona does mm. yes kulingana na wana psychologia huku sheria za kujitenga zikizidi kudhibitiwa familia nyingi zinazidi kukabiliana na changamoto za kisaikolojia tishio kubwa kwao most of us are feeling helpless like what can i do you know um, how do i get out of this when does this come to an end and also this brings in a lot of anxiety at an individual basis and then this extends now to the family mawasiliano ya mara kwa mara kuweka mambo wazi ni miongoni mwa mbinu familia hii imetumia ili kuimarisha uhusiano wao msimu huu wa janga la corona i like creating a lot of time with them because i'm a, i'm busy when i'm like i work long schedules we usually say in counseling it's not what happens to us that affects us but how we think about what is happening that actually does affect us so you need to restructure your thinking instead of saying i'm locked up at home you're saying i'm actually staying home to keep safe instead of saying i'm locked up with my children you can actually say this is a good time for me to bond and get to know my children this is also a very good time to equip life skills in our children in terms of covid it's the best time to teach resilience as a family sit down and agree this is an familiar territory which means that um you don't know what the day brings you're not sure um especially if your income i think that is causing a lot of stress to people kando na changamoto za kisaikolojia zinazochangiwa na virusi vya corona wakenya pia wameonekana wakibadili mienendo yao haswa kuhusiana na mada hiyo kama anavyotueleza mtaalamu wa masuala ya mawasiliano find that these cases where domestic violence has actually gone up because you'll find that people um abusers in the form of parents in the form of spouses even in the form of siblings so there is that there is a lot of um tension in that area however there is also an opportunity for families to also rebuild um um and their communication in this sense our humanity needs to be uh, strengthened in this when we are able to empathize um understand each other's language be patient with each other because really there's no way we are going we are all stuck home so be patient listen a little bit more than you would listen so active listening at this point is also important we need to go back to the basics of mental health which is first acknowledging how you're feeling taking some time to actually acknowledge that yes i'm angry yes i'm depressed yes yes i'm anxious 
and then working through these emotions. Janga la corona bila shaka imeleta matatizo ya kiaina yake. Miongoni mwa changamoto ambazo zinakumbwa wa Kenya ikiwa ni changamoto za kisaikolojia. Aidha sasa familia zimeshauriwa kusali hapa pamoja na kuwasiliana mara kwa mara. Shukri wachu K24 Nairobi.